And welcome back, everybody, to Fishing Simulator 2021. Can you please leave me alone? Only when it's the voice is filmed. Hole. Set his genitals on fire and throw him into the lake. I would if PvP wasn't isn't uh if he wasn't protected from PvP at the moment. The voices aren't talking to you, Matthew. They might be. I wish I had lore three on this poll. I remember when me, you, and Adam would all just stand around the Lake of Souls and Jotun and just fish for some goods. Are you going to make a new one? Probably. Yes. Also yeah. probably going to make a new nether village somewhere. It's going to be way better than our old one. <laughs> yeah. I've done it. My, my experiment on it is been done pretty much one is it possible the whole reason I did it is to see if it was even possible and we did it yeah surprisingly it was I mean so the food situation's stupid but other than that it wasn't that bad hey I'm level 10 fisherman now I mean, hey, all that it would, uh, all that would need to be changed is that there be a type of nether crop that can be freely harvested by villagers. I got a bow. Yeah, Charlie, I'm just gonna say this: I would be level twenty, but uh, you know, every single time you've changed the mod. Uh, sure. Well, change. You no, know, I never. Thing? You know, I never changed it. Like I, I yeah. never even actually removed it. I just disabled it. And added another one, then removed the other one, and re-enabled the the uh, Drops Reborn plugin. I never yes, actually made single, a change. Yes, every single time you did that, it reset all the points. It's not that I actually did that. It was I this, reset my points. That other crap. Because I was level 10 fishman, now, then I was back to level, level 1, now I'm back to level 16. Come on. Two... Upgrading my boat to have power five, it's too expensive. How expensive? Yeah, yeah. No, it just be says very too expensive. Careful about that. Remember, every time you make edits on it, the thing takes longer and longer to. Okay, yeah, I'm gonna have to alter these settings. Might as well just take the XP off of that then. And, um,. It just says too expensive, man. It means it's not possible. It's not possible to do in survival mode. you got to be very careful about it. It's far easier if you put all the different enchanted books that you want together before you even try and put them on it. While well, I was combining a, a bow, I pulled up with fishing. Which means the one I disenchanted, I should have kept. Because it probably wouldn't have been able to do it just fine. The one you disenchanted still had work done to it, though. Disenchantment also counts as work. No, no, I, I disenchanted it to get the XP off of it, trying to get XP to be able to combine the other two. But it also had power four. Right. Yeah, you should never repair one of those weapons that you find until you're absolutely sure that you have all the enchantments you want on it. Well, it has mending on it. So I don't repair it. I've decided that mending is better than infinity. Mending really is better than infinity because infinity just means that you'll never run out of arrows, but your bow will eventually become too expensive to repair. Yep. And mending means you've just got to get arrows, which skeleton farms aren't hard to make. you just got to find a spawner. Gosh darn it. Matthew slept. By the way, if you know the seed, you can actually locate skeleton spawners. You I do know the seed. You can locate a of any type. I do know the seed, actually. Well, then I could show you how to find it. <laughs> I 
That just lagged a little bit. Okay. Okay, well, on the to-do list, I need to modify the maturation speed for dinosaurs and Chad, the uh, yeah. imprint. Did you just timer. snatch my bow? Uh, let me check. I don't know. No, I did not. Where are where'd, you? Then where'd my bow disappear to? I'm not even near you. You're I'm at, at, I'm at the stupid lake still. I'm in my house, then my, as soon as I walked in, my bow disappeared out of my inventory. And now it it's back. It was clearly the server telling you that your bow needs to go away. It might have just been a glitch. Or no. so Charlie stole it. I and don't think Charlie has the commands to look into your inventory right now. Yeah, I do. I have it now. Now I'm gonna deal with all of this. Charlie, can you look at my inventory real quick? Yeah, well, I should probably do the command. No, I in V C Crusher O nine. What are you looking for? Holy crap! How much? How much EXP do you think I'm gonna get from all of this? One or two levels. Well, shit. A lore three. You have a lore three. Mm -hmm. Fuck, bring that shit to me. Right? I'm good yeah. to... Bring that shit to me. I'm good till I sell it, motherfucker. I did. I think this was... Oh, you have a mending hoe? Charlie, will you do me a favor? No. Will you bring me the cookie brownie out of the icebox? You got th two mending hoes? With a fork... I might just might hold on. Let me go combine these two fishing rods together. And then I'll have the perfect fishing rod, I do believe, right? See, luck of the C3, lore 3, unbreaking 3, and mending. Does that sound perfect, Alex? Mm. Near about, yeah. I can't think of anything else you could even put on one of these. I'll be right back. Someone, please keep the guest entertained. I'm not yeah, guest. Shit. <laughs> You didn't bring me a fork. Bring me a fork. <laughs> I'm not going to eat it with my fingers.
All right, which one of y'all stripped for them? Nobody. Why? Because <laughs> fuck you. Bitch. Well, this one doesn't seem to show me anything. hell was that? Good question. If this map is right, there's about... 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21. A, a bunch of, of guardians in a single spot. But it ain't telling me where the spawners are. Oh well, it's fine. Fuck it. Time to go. Why do I have a golden hope? Gosh darn it, Matt. <laughs> and the curse of vanishing? Yeah, I have no clue what the hell that is. Uh, it's a curse that makes it disappear from your inventory once you die and not leave a drop. Oh. Well, have fun with that, Charlie. I just threw it on the ground. I'll give it five minutes to despawn. Where are you at? Where do you think I'm at? Hey, I just got something. You took it. How, what, how did I take it? Because you spawned inside of me. I was behind you. I didn't even spawn. I just straight ran up behind you. No, you TP to me, you rodent. No, I didn't. I ran here. I got it on video. Yeah, you didn't run here. I just watched you TP inside of me. No, I threw a bobber inside of you. Right, do you want this clown fish, boy? You should eat it. I'm not hungry enough. <laughs> oh, and I'll be back. It's pretty deep right here underneath your pier. Okay, now now I've got some hunger. What there are you, you running your mouth about, boy? Huh? What are you running your mouth about? Said I wasn't hungry enough to eat the clownfish, so I had to run around and make myself hungry. And then I said it's very deep underneath his pier. And then I came back up and ate the clownfish. How dare you eat the clown fish? Could have ate the puffer fish. Hey Matt, why are you torturing that poor squid over there? Cause it's fun. Huh? The squid over there just died in your sugar cane. Well, it's not my fault he's stupid enough to go into my sugar cane. <laughs> you don't, don't you know? Squids are attracted to it. This is why we must get rid of sugar canes and bring back plastic straws. Oh yeah, so I could get turtles. <laughs> How ridiculous. I mean, I've never seen a Minecraft turtle die in a in a in a sugar cane. Ooh, what was that? Punch two, loyalty three. Punch two ain't too bad. I'm gonna punch you. I wish we wouldn't. Why not? Cause. 
And sure, I don't know why, but I think it's getting dark. I don't know why you think that. Hmm, the house sure. looks so weird over there. Yeah, it looks like oh, and I just got a bow. Mending curse of vanishing flame. At least it's got mending. <clears throat> Hey, Charlie, there's a zombie about to attack you. Oh, and I got another book. This is... Where'd it go? I got another fishing rod. I got a mending fishing rod. I got a curse of binding, protection three, and luck of the sea. A what fishing rod? Does anybody need obsidian? Kind of obsidian. Obsidian? Crying or non crying? It literally just says obsidian. Seems kind of sus to me. So, three zombies, I mean, three villagers just died somewhere. Okay, so then I won't bring it to y'all then. I'm good. Okay, Matt, stop catching shit because I keep pulling mine back. That's not my fault I got lore 3. I also have lore 3, damn it. It's not my fault, mine's better. I'll let him stay down there, that'll be fine. I don't want any more drowned under my fucking pier. Man, I'm starting to think you're the one that dragged them all down there. Hey, Charlie, you know, I'm trying to make this drown farm. farm. What? So, do you remember the annoying orange? Yes, I oh, do. No. Okay. Do you remember Fred? Yep. Yep. What do these two have in common? They're don't okay. really know. Mm, no, that, I don't think they actually are homosexual, Cassie. Actually, Fred is. Oh, well, he goes uh, by Lucas Crookshank now, and he has his own YouTube channel, which I follow. And his brother is also gay now. He had his own YouTube channel before he was called Lucas Crookshank. <laughs> it was called Fred. <laughs> yeah, um, but now he's just Lucas Crookshank. Yeah, yeah. Well, you know what the difference is? What? Uh, or what the relationship is. They both had a TV show. They ah! jumped from the internet to television, proceeded to crash and burn, and have now faded into relative obscurity. I've been sleeping. Why are they attacking yeah, me? But Lucas is still very popular. The people who watch The Annoying Orange would also tell you that, but it's not true. They're nowhere oh, near no. as popular Lucas? as they used to be. Lucas is not like he used to be. Oh, my God, man. Lucas does a lot of stuff like Dova Dobrik and stuff like that, but mm -hmm. he is still very, very popular. But not for being Fred. He's popular for just being himself. Mm. And also, people like him because he has really high friends in high places. Which allows him to do stupid shit. But yeah, he does a lot of, like, reaction videos. So, like, if you have, like, a dance mom, and he'll show, like, an episode of it, and he'll do, like, a reaction video to it. Right. So that's what he's mostly into. Charlie, why do I hear Enderman? Don't worry about it. Because Charlie's on crack. Did somebody go to bed? Yes, it's Cassie morning. did. I mean, Matthew did. Is it morning? Yes. yes. Okay. I was stuck in a house with no windows. Hey, Matt, I really like your friend there. Thanks, fam. I named him Jerome. Can, can I get a lily pad, please? Never mind. Hey, you take that bitch on. That bitch go. Fuck with me, I fucked your mom. Bring it back. Oh, God, oh, God, he came back, he came back. <laughs> Bring it, bitch. Did you see your guest down there? How about you go say hi to him? I'm good. Ah, you piece of shit. Suck of shit. I said go say hi. I'm trying to fish. And I said go say hi to the people you put in my basement. 
I didn't put them in your basement. That's pretty much my basement pier. Have some more fish. And a bone. I always knew you smelled like fish. I think I'm done fishing today. You fish smelling ass. You are a fish smelling ass. No, that's you. Y'all are both retarded. Thank you. Yeah, we is. Where's my axe? Up your ass. I have a, I have a iron axe here somewhere, and it's almost dead. I found it. Can I not spell spawn? Don't answer that. No. Fuck you. Sorry, but I don't take offers. But Cassie said it wasn't an offer. It's a threat. Or a promise. I Is it a promise? Nothing. I don't Give think it. Casey said anything, Greg kid. She, she thought it, though. I didn't think it either. Oh. Maybe that was Alex's brainwaves. Man, you got a point there. <laughs> Suspecting something tastes as junk. Wait, what? Charlie, you did say we needed silk touch, right? Yeah, why? Well. I have just received it. Now, guess what? What? You're gay? No. Come get here and make something with this damn thing. Because I do not feel like it. Hey, Alex joined the game. Mm -hmm. Who's this Alex you speak of? I'm currently cutting down the giant, and I mean the giant forest of uh, spruce trees that Marty placed. Is this in a brain? Why did you come to me? Because I'm giving you this. Why are you giving it to me? Because I don't feel like spending my EXP to make to make a shovel. But you don't use a shovel on it. Technically, all you have to do is use a pickaxe, and then you can harvest anything that needs soap touch. Hmm. This is getting me a lot of XP, yeah. though. Yeah. Give that back. Why? Does it want it back now? No, it's mine now. You can't get it back. Charlie? Too bad. Hey. Too bad. Not for you. Make me a diamond axe, and I will give it back. Shit, I already got Charlie, one. Charlie, I have diamond axe down in my basement. Fully repaired diamond axe with unbreaking. Nope. And you got my basement. Breaking part. Okay, I'm just going to go get one. How about, from... efficiency? How about efficiency, too? No. How about efficiency, too? No. Raise your price every time he makes a dumbass offer. I'm thinking about it, too. I think I have, like I said, I think I have one in my dungeon, but I'm not for sure. So who wants Cash to buy a up. shit ton of wood? No. I got a shit ton of it now. Well, no one wants to buy it. Oh, you're hey, gonna buy it? And you're back gonna here, buy it. Talking to me? What's on this axe? Unbreaking 3 and efficiency 3. Alright, bye. Hey! That was not the deal! What are you gonna that do? Take it from me? That we were going to honor. It was a terrible deal from the start. It's worse than the Biden administration's energy policy. Yeah, well, I'm probably about to break this entire axe pretty damn quick. 
Yeah, you know, I'd be very careful using um, tree assist on these uh, giant trees. Why? Well, look, um, my netherite unbreaking three mending axe yeah. could take down maybe three of those trees at once. Yeah. The, it, in one sitting, and then would need to be repaired. Well, so here's the thing. I don't know if the tree assist actually uses up extra durability or not. Nope. So it I would be very it by careful log. about using it. No, it does it by log because if you run out of durability, it stops cutting the tree. Oh, okay. It's it's literally tree capitator, just modern. He just placed them everywhere. Hey, I found a bamboo forest. I think that's what these are. Hey, yep. Charlie. Can you check how much balance I got right now? Um, why? Because it's about to be changing. You currently have four three zero six. Uh, wow. Can you tell me how much I have now? You have less, probably. You now have four three zero six. Did it increase? No. Yes. Just for that, I'm going to put in the command to make it decrease. Uh, I uh, it. I don't think that list updates that quick, Matt. How dare you? You still have 4306. For fact, me, I have 46. <sighs> okay. So you gain another 600. I now have 4314. Because of these stupid trees over here. I surprisingly have not broken this axe yet. Let's see, whose place was this again? So, Matt, you enjoying that uh, silk touch? Mm-hmm. Are you now? Mm-hmm. Are you really? No, we can't have that. So you did say, wait, what did I need? Crimson Nilium? Nilium? Are you in the nether? Yes. 
Hold on. Oh, TP to me. TP. Uh, Alright, follow me. Hold on. I think my flop broke. Yeah. Over here. The dirt stuff. Hey, watch out for these pigs. Mmm, crispy. He dropped leather, huh? Here, have some food. I already got food, though. Yep, that's exotic. Why would you shoot the baby pig? Because he was also going for me. Okay. I'll get a stack and then I'll be doing this. If not... Charlie, something's weird about the zombie AI in spawn. Why is that? Well, normally the zombies just sort of walk around blindly and chase after villagers. Yeah. Well... They're actually going after the golems. Yeah, they uh, do that when they seal them. They're supposed to do that. I never saw the zombies ever go after the golems in Jotun. That's because it was a realm server. AI yeah, was broken as hell. But they're actually supposed to do that in Java Edition. So you said this is a fish house, right? Uh, yeah, yeah. Should I sell fish here? Is there a point to sell fish here? Well, no, of course not. There are villagers that could do that. I know. Could I put any kind of market here? Well, you could sell blue ice and shit. I mean... It's frustrating as hell to get a hold of normally, so it probably wouldn't be a bad idea to sell it here. Otherwise, you could just normally trade for half the shit fishermen sell. True. Yeah, main reason I combined the ice house and the uh, fish house together is it just makes sense. I mean, who wants rotten, hot fish? Now, is there some reason you covered the entire roof with this, except for one tile with uh, trip wires? Huh? Oh, yes. Did I not get them all? Yeah. There's <laughs> actually a exact reason. Um, it was spawning lots of mobs. Hmm. And that stops it. Interesting. Um, I don't know if these were or not, but that one really was. And it keeps the snow from on top. I don't think these were here whenever I did that. Hmm. But if, if they're spawning lots of mobs, I'll do the same thing. Alright, well, let's grab a slab. A stone slab. I think I need to make a crack house. No, it's a wood city. slab. A crack house? Oh, yeah. No, I wouldn't complain either. Yep, and I'll name all of the different kind of items I'm using as drugs. Alright. So, Alex, just a quick question. In the creative menu, there is an item called Petrified Oak Slab. What the hell is that? Let me take a look. Where is it? In the, in the block, building blocks tab... Scroll down till you see the slabs, and then right before the cobblestone slab is petrified oak slab. Hmm. I have no idea, but I'm about to find out.
And now the ice shops are now admin shops. Oh, I can tell you how to use it. Um, yeah. So a petrified oak slab slab cannot actually be made in vanilla Minecraft. Okay. It is an item available only to people in creative mode for one particular purpose. I know it has the um uh, the stone sound effect. I know that much. It is actually just a stone slab with a wood texture. That's it. Yeah, it's useful if you ever wanted to make something that would not burn. Okay. I was curious. So you said you're gonna finish this tomorrow? I may start working on it in a few minutes actually, once I finish my uh brownies. Mm -hmm. Brownies, you son of a bitch. What was this area here, where the snow's now gone? Uh, it was an annoying, weirdly made lake, and I'm going to let this fill back in. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. Um, Alright then. Um, Yeah, because this area here spawns a bunch of mobs. Over here, anyway. Oh, it's all going to get developed and lit up real quick. Yeah, no. Uh, my biggest thought was, you know, there you got spots where you don't have steps, where it steps up and steps down. Just a few spots. That was really my biggest thought. And then, of course, right here, coming up to the fountain, it's still pretty rough. Okay, again, things I am planning on working on, Charlie. I know. All right, well, I guess I'm going to go back to my house. Since Matthew got all the stuff he wants now. Oh, by the way, no one ever managed to find my secret drug house in Yoten. Doesn't surprise me. Or at least they never said nothing if they did. Oh, no, they would have said something if they found it. <laughs> Probably. You would hope so, at least. Yeah, no, they managed to find the Temple of Yggdrasil, but they did not find that. <laughs> Interesting. So you've had your little worker working on spawn, have you? Not on spawn, no. Hold on. No, I'd say she has been working on spawn. Are you looking at the walls? Oh yeah, I'm looking at the walls. Yeah, that's me. Oh, that's you? You've been putting the mossy cobblestone brick in at random intervals? Actually, yeah. I used world edit and did um did a random interval um replace and, for uh, cobble. And I put the pillars around the outsides as well, just to kind of break up the flatness is all. Hmm. That's all I did, and then I haven't really finished it either. And um, the gates going in and out of the cities, I did a little bit of work on the outsides of them, just to kind of make them look different a little bit. Hmm. I've just done a little bit. It's all been on the outside, though. She has been working on the district way over here outside of spawn. I'm internally arguing about whether or not I should set you on fire. If only there was a command for that, right? Close enough, I guess. Yep. What kind of flowers does... What kind of dye does lilac give you? Magenta, okay. Ouch! Yeah, I was worried you weren't getting the point. <laughs> I wish there was more big flowers. They're easier to get. When you got a bunch of big ones. So why is there a bunch of ice? To oh, wow. So this is like a floating 3D item shop? Yeah. If you right-click on it, right. you can see the menu. Mm, that's interesting. I just left them at the recommended prices. 
I'm sure that's fine. Sod does not like there's a ton of liquidity and usefulness for ice anyway, other than decorative purposes. Mm-hmm. 